All right, family, it's your brother Assad, and I'm back again with another quick vlog. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified when we drop new material on this channel. Secondly, in terms of housekeeping, I gotta give a special and a significant and a particular and a peculiar shout out to my South African family, all the other guys who show this channel, my wife, myself, my children. We greatly appreciate it. So today, we are gonna do a little Ramadan shot. And I wanted to do this so that we can do like some little price comparisons uh, to what's going on in the U.S. So I'm here at Pick and Pay. And uh, I want to pick up some stuff for Ramadan. Alright, so I gotta get some bananas. Gotta get some lemons, because I like, uh, I like my lemons. Gotta get some grapes. Gotta get some oranges as we say in New Orleans. Although I know it's cheaper to buy the whole watermelon, often I can't eat the whole watermelon at one time, and it usually sits in the refrigerator in the bag. So I like to buy the slices, because I know I can sit down at one time and eat the slices. So I'm getting some more. You can never go wrong with some tomato. Gotta get you some tomato. Got a bell pepper. The bell pepper. Gotta get the yellow and the red pepper. You see the brown bread, it says slow release and energy, which is great because when you make a sandwich in the morning before Ramadan starts, you get up before the sunrise, make your little sandwich, this might hold you for a little longer, so you will get some of this slow release and energy brown bread. The incredible edible egg. Gotta get you some egg. I'm gonna get me some of these Simply Chicken Viennas. See right there where it says, where it says, no pork, no pork. You're going to get these. I'm real hood, and I do stuff like, I'll take that, and cut that up, and put that in some, uh, some canned beans. Don't talk about it. That's how I get that. Ooh, that look like a whole bird right there. Oh, yeah, you got to get you some of that chicken. That look like a whole bird. You're going to take that bird, and we're going to do something good to that bird, just know. All right, so Pick and Pay sells this um, this chicken already cooked. Y'all from New Orleans know about like Rouse's and Rouse's love chicken, you know, like hot food balls. So I got this just for us now. Now, typically, I wouldn't do frozen seafood, frozen shrimp, because I'm from a place with food, food water and we get our stuff fresh. This is cool. Uh, if you want to make a quick, easy meal, so you know, do a Ramadan at home. Thinking, oh, dear God, I can't wait to eat something, right? And you could start cooking early. Sometimes you don't have the time. So when it's time to eat, you could either run out to a restaurant, and spend money, or you could take these these shrimp right here, or as we would say, these scrumps. You could take the shrimp, make you a quick, uh, out like a sauce, like a little butter sauce, Alfredo sauce. Put that over some pasta. Bam, 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 just like that. Bam, 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 just like that. You got a meal. So I get this little uh, plain yogurt, mix it with my um, fruit, and that's like a nice little snack too. Gotta get some milk. My son, Austin, loves to drink a glass of milk. These things are full of soda. They're super duper unhealthy. But uh, the kids home from school, they need something to eat. Better go make you some noodles. So here's the thing about language and how people identify stuff. So uh, here's a few things I'm about to point out. Uh, so these say kidney beans, right? But they're white. Now red beans are kidney beans. What we call red beans in the world, they're kidney beans, but they're red. They're all this color. Let me put this down. They're almost this color. But these say red speckled beans. Right? Red speckled beans. So, I don't know. I'm going to go with the shape versus the color. I'm going to go with the shape versus the color. So, these also say quick soak. Why, why is this a great Ramadan meal? Because you can soak these beans in, starting in the morning and uh, put them on and let them slow cook for hours. Pop them in a slow cooker and let them slow cook for hours. And by the time it's time to eat, they're ready. So your whole house is smelling like good food being cooked. Meanwhile, you know, you fasting, and then bam, 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 when the dime go off, bam, 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 when it's time to eat, you can run to the pot. So 
we're gonna put one, two of them in there. Remember I told you I take them in a can of beans, cut up them uh, chicken bananas in there. Bam, bam, bam. So I'm gonna get me two cans of these. Let me make sure they ain't got no pork in Let me make sure. All right, looks like we good to go. So I'm gonna get me a couple of cans of these little beans here. One of them. Let me get me one more. Yeah. You, you don't know. You talking about some good eating? You put that on the slow cooker, add your little cayenne pepper, a little some little seasoning and stuff, right? Yes, Lord. Then you cut up your little uh, chicken vienna in there, put you a pot of rice on, add just a little honey, just a little honey, give it a little sweet taste. Not to your rice, to the beans. Then bam, 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 just like that, you got your food. A food that's good to eat, you know, so. Yeah, yeah, I'm about to put that down. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we have jungle oats, jungle oats. No name, quick cooking oats. That's what I'm going I don't like them. I don't know them. Jungle oats, I don't even know about no name. But at least he keeping it real. No name keeping it real. I ain't got no name. Get me a cereal. Well, that's really for the kids. Want some cereal. Fellas, if you go over to our house and she ain't got no honey in the house, you can't trust her. She gotta have some honey in the house. How is she gonna be sweet? You get it? Be sweet. So I usually use jelly back in the United States, but I noticed that ain't a whole lot of jelly in the picking kit, so we're gonna roll with this jam. You gotta get the peanut butter that's just like me, smooth and brown. Ha ha ha! Biscuit rings. These ain't no damn biscuits, man. These cookies. That's a cookie. These ain't no biscuits, that's a cookie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. biscuit rings. You gotta be kidding me. But we gonna get one anyway. Gotta get you some mouthwash now. You know, you gotta keep your mouth from smelling like, you know, you know. Now I gotta buy three deodorants. Deodorants. <laughs> Cause I got me and two boys. And yes, they have hit that age. Yes, Lord, they have hit that age. Wow. All right, got to get a couple of bottles of water. I'm going to get two cases of these. This is six a piece. And the children, they'll lay up there and open a bottle, put it down, forget about it, and then go with another bottle. So we're going to do these on this All right, all right, all right. I think that's it. Now we're going to go and uh, clock out, check out, and uh, see how much this came up. So the total was 16 92.75 and ran 1692.75 and ran which is about $90 so I got a cart full of stuff for about $90 you really can't beat it in my time so my American family let me know what y'all would pay for a shopping cart similar to this let me know alright family peace